welcome to my playhouse and today or right now I've discovered that I have a bad disc in my Dell Ecologic Sand Array so uh, right now I'm gonna make a little video about changing a disc so let's first go out to the sand and see the problem And up here is the problem. I have a warning here and I have a bad disc. Number 12 has become red. So what you do is you go in and you look at the software. This array is way out of guarantee so I've logged into the software and I found that it's not able to recognize disk number 12 anymore. This array is running RAID 6 and it has two hotspares. So it has already uh, put in the hotspare and is right now only just showing that there's a disk failure. So I'm gonna I'm gonna exchange that disk and put in another one. The disk size of this array, there are, every disk is uh, 750 gigabytes, which is about 700 gigabytes when you look at it here. Right there. And right there is the failed one. Failed. And it gives you a nice a nice view here of the disk filling so let's exchange that And okay, that's a bit hard to see. It's a Seagate 750 gigabytes, 7200 rounds per minute. And I have another one here. It's another used disk um, taken out of another array but just removing the screws here Oops. and taking out the disc taking in the other disc it's a uh, these are ordinary SATA discs uh, pretty normal ones I think they are a bit high end but otherwise normal hard drives there we are ready to be installed again Kind of difficult to do with one hand, but there it is. Okay, here we are. 
and it should look at the disk in just a few seconds. There it is, it's checking the disk. There's still a warning on, that's because um, I have another problem with the interface on the back side of this array. Um, not gonna look into that right now, but but I'm gonna take the disc with me. That's the bad one. And we're gonna go look at the software. software is now showing that it's it's not bad anymore but it's oh it says that this disk has a history of failure that's not that good Let's see if it's... I'm gonna use it anyway. There. Okay, it's, it might not be the perfect disk to have in the array, but uh, it has been on the shelf for half a year at least, so it's probably not become any better, but let's see what happens. It's not, it's not, this array is pretty safe, it's a, as I said, it's a, a RAID 6 with two hot spares. So what will happen is if another disk fails, like let's say this one fails, and it goes in and say, oh, we'll use number 12 again. It will uh, use number 12 and then number 12 will fail. And we have two failed disks. Then it will use the next hot spare, which is number nine. And let's number nine is probably good and even with number nine uh, and you, you know like zero hot spares with raid six you can still lose two discs so it's pretty safe so that's how uh, how i exchange a disc in my array I hope you found that interesting. Um, the Dell Ecologic uh, PS100E array, which uh, is this one. Actually, uh, it's probably the PS400E, but the only the only difference be between the arrays are the are the size of the discs and. Um, well, the sizes of the disks in my array in the one we saw was 750 gigabytes, but it's actually possible to uh, to update that. Um, I have another array out there that uh, is being used with two terabytes of disks, and um, so it's it's actually possible to just exchange all the disks, and you will have an, a new array. Um, so. I hope you found that uh, little video interesting. Do subscribe to my channel and give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. And you'll see me again. Have a nice day. Bye bye.